Yeah, we on Boss Talk TV. Shout out to Ehe, the reason you see. Nothing better than what I got in my mind, Rooch. I don't understand. Johnny wants to put some smile in my mind because he didn't want to go the size that I didn't want want to go to because he didn't want to do what I wanted to do for the money I'm trying to drop. I ain't trying to do this. I don't want no free. He wanted to give me some free that was way smaller than this. I don't want no free. I want some of my money and I want to go over the top, best of the best, biggest of the biggest, uh, make it work. Like, that's not going to fit. It's not going to fit in your mouth. But correct. It's not going to, I don't give a fuck if it's going to fit. Make it fit. So I went to a nigga that made it fit. Nigga that made it happen. Give a damn about what you're talking about. I don't want nothing for free. I don't want no free diamond mob. I don't want a free diamond boy chain for my partners to pass it around with all my with and the rest of my gangsters. That's what it's for. I said I want the biggest diamonds possible going in, to go on my teeth. It's uncomfortably comfortable. I knew it was going to make my, my lips poke out. That's the point. I ain't even f I wanted to win the Diamond Award. I said, put I know I'm helping And them all really fit fleshy. They fit fleshy. I, I'm talking about, you feel me? Just force it. That's what you know with it. But I don't give a f like a rich king from Switzerland. I don't give a f if it doesn't fit. My money says it does. Make it fucking fit. Harla. Wow, wow. Hey, guys, man. Uh, this year, I've been covering ever since this been going on. Um, man, my boy, <laughs> Sauce Walker, done spoke back. He clapped back again this morning. Uh, he just was kind of, well, it was last night, but he was like, man, I like my, and it could be early, early, but he was like, I like my, uh, okay, let's go back. Trill Talk No Pill Talk said yesterday on here that his grill was too big, that it was too big and it didn't fit his mouth. Well, Sauce come back today and said that was the whole reason why he didn't, you know, go to Johnny Dane because Johnny Dane was trying to make it small. He wanted the big diamonds. One thing about Sauce Walker, he's a trendsetter. What he does is he sets the trends in motion for what he wants. And I love that about him. He a real Texas hardhead. That's one thing we do. The things they do uh, here in Texas, the thing we do here in Texas, we don't really go by nobody rules. So. He did that because he wanted it that way. And, and I could believe him because I know how he is. He going to do whatever he want to do. Y'all don't remember when he put the emerald in his face? He did that before uh, the, the little dude Uzi Vert. He did that first. So you got to understand, Sauce is one that's going to always step up, do things the way he want to do them, and he don't care what nobody else thinks about what he does. And that's why he's really, really like the MVP when it comes down to the youngsters on his level doing what he do. That's why it's hard to really, really, you can't gauge him. You know, whether it be OnlyFans, whether it be whatever he decides to do. The ooh the the, 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 the uh, when he had the bows in his hair, all kind of stuff. He has, he's unapologetically himself and it, it works for him. So you gotta respect who he is and how he coming with what he does. But I'm telling you right now, Johnny Dane, I was pissed off about this. He did not like the fact that he went to somebody else, also said that he would have gave him to him for free. And and at the end of the day, you think that's a good deal. But he said, no, I didn't want him for the free this time. I wanted what I wanted, and I know Johnny Dane was going to put in smaller grill in my mouth. I don't know, man. Like I said, man, I had to do some research on this, look at it. I, I'm, I'm telling you, I love the way uh, Sauce sets trends. But I can see why Johnny Dame is mad, too, because they've been friends for 20 years and he always came to him. But this is business at the end of the day. So this is business. So at the end of the day, with this being business, you already know what it is. He doing what he doing. He doing business. But I got reality TV and she feel the pop it on me like, hey, man, uh, how she feel about the grill? Did you see the grill? You, know it. you seen the grill? I'm coming. Let me say this. And hey, my boy, Trill Talk, no Trill Talk defense. I feel like people are entitled to their own opinion. So if he feel like that's that's how he feel, that's how he feel. Okay. Regardless okay. Of, you know. But anyway, um Did you see I, the grill? But I mean I I agree with you to, if you want my honest opinion, I really think the whole gold teeth uh, I mean the I me, I personally 
I think it's a waste of money, but hey, so he's his own. But um, I, I, he is a transcendent. He do his own thing, and I respect that that he has his own style and he do his own thing. I respect anybody that do that. So, but in Johnny Dane, to me, I felt like he was saying that that he was disrespecting his name when he said. With the, the other jeweler name, no Johnny Dane. You know, when he said that, I feel like that's when Johnny Dane felt like he was disrespected. Not that he went to somebody else. Because he was saying that. He well, was, I mean, uh, it, it, it's weird because he. That's what it sounded like to me that he was upset about. Not him going to somebody else. Well, he said he already did the grill. If you go back and listen to the first one he first talked about, he had already did the grill, did, took his, you know, he already had did it because he was going to do it for free. And and you don't think he felt like his time was disrespected? I mean, yeah. I feel like anybody will feel like their time is disrespected. Because that's something you can't get back. Because he was saying that he was going to do it for free, and he already had the mold, and you could see the uh, the two. He, he picked the teeth up, held them right there, right. and let people see, hey, man, I had already started this. We were going out to dinner together. You know, you can hardly understand him, but... He say he, they eat dinner together and they friends and this here just really took him by surprise. But he did say he disrespected his name too. Put some respect on my name. <laughs> like, like, uh, baby. Yeah, he tried to pull that bird man, but you can't. He can't do that bird man. You know, nobody ain't bird man. No, <laughs> uh, bird man, one of the realest, and uh, when it come down to put some respect on my name, that was original bars. I love South Walker, though. Like I, I, man, South Walker, Texas, man, they ain't playing no game. Matter of fact, I'm probably going to post our picture finally today when we met up in Vegas. I think I'm going to post that on my Instagram today. That man is a hustling man, and I, I respect him to the fullest. He going to hustle. He get out here and he do it. You know, I've seen this man do things that I haven't seen nobody do in this time, right. you know, uh, far as for his brand and how he holding it down. So I definitely respect what he's doing He's a, he, like I say, a trendsetter. That's all I was saying. And he, he a cool person, too. Oh, man, good dude, man. Real good dude, real good. And he helping a lot of people, too. Don't get it twisted. He he putting, he changing lives, and that's what we love down here in Texas. We've always had some patriarchs that change lives. He wanted them changing life type dudes, man. I I think his whole team is is, is, is doing their thing. I just want everybody to keep working, keep grinding, keep your head down, keep your chest out, uh, pushing, pushing forward, you know. And he and I think he's one of them ones that's going to keep doing that, man. So, man, just uh, all I can say is I, ho I hate him and Johnny Dane going back and forth like this, but I don't know. This was one, well, this message here was strictly, this was straight, straight at him this time, like straight hardcore at him. So, I don't know. I don't. I don't know because South's been in the in the algorithm like lately a lot. So I, it might be a good thing. <laughs> hey, hey! All I know is Johnny Dane need to get them teeth done and get them get them necklaces out today. It's Saturday. We got a pump today. We got the pump today. But hey, man, <laughs> make sure you guys get in the comments. Let me know, man. Is Sauce pushing it by 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 reiterating the fact of he wanted a bigger grill? Do you guys like the way that grill look? Do y'all love the way Sauce's grill turned out, or do you like Johnny Dane's better? That's the question I'm asking. Whose grill do you like better, the one Johnny Dane be doing, or the one that Sauce decided to go with? You got both of them on this uh, video here. Just look, the one Johnny Dane did where they standing there, or the new one that he got that's going bling blow blow. Man, check it, man. Thank you guys, man. Appreciate you, man. Keep watching. This is Boss Talk 101 with a Boss Talk, man. This has been another Boss Talk 101 with you. Let me know how you like them, man. 100. Yep, got them yellows, got them purples, got them reds. Life's gonna hit it, make you woozy.